Okay, this one's out of season, but the season will, will roll on quickly from, from now on, I suppose. I found this in a news agent and it looked like it was from last Christmas. Yeah, it's about Christmas. Now, you, now I've just blown the lid off the can, so to speak. Something to do with Christmas. We've just done Christmas in July. That's all done and dusted, so to speak. So now we've got something for, that's from probably from last year that didn't sell. I don't know if I did get it at a bargain or if I paid the normal price. But it was just there. I figured I'd take it. <laughs> so let's see how this looks. Uh, it is Christmas accessories, Christmas scatters. So yes, scatters as they call them. A little bit scatterbrained. I don't know why these Christmas items didn't sell. Sometimes I wonder. So we just put it up into the corner. But yeah, Christmas, indeed. I used to love Christmas because it was the time when my dad would open his purse strings and buy us some good presents, usually ones that I wanted. Even though my dad's an asshole, and he, did, he didn't allow, allow me to have pocket money. Uh, he always wanted me to do housework for pocket money, but I'm not good at housework. I just can't motivate myself to do it. Now that looks a bit dark. I can't motivate myself to do it. I'm not good at housework. Uh, and I think my dad probably knew that, used that as an advantage to prevent me from having much spending money. But money's not everything, folks. I'm gonna hold this up on an angle and see what happens. I'm just gonna use my, oh, I just pressed the button twice accidentally with my camera hand. But basically, yeah, I, I just didn't have the motivation to do housework. Or I'm not good at it. I'm not good at organising messy things. Uh, so I, I missed out on pocket money. <laughs> I just couldn't motivate myself. Now that looks good. I just couldn't motivate myself. Uh, and as a consequence, I didn't get pocket money. Ha! <laughs> and I tried to in my high school years get a job. I could never find a job in a supermarket so I was reliant on my parents for money and they weren't really generous. Uh, I wanted to work. I could never get a job in a supermarket or a Target or a McDonald's. I felt like I was being discriminated against uh, but for some reason I never landed a job in any of those kinds of places. I just couldn't get myself into anything so I had to fucking well miss out and I didn't have, I wanted to buy things like music and you know, I wanted to do my photocopier art, I wanted to buy my own photocopier and I just didn't have the money to do it because my parents weren't giving much money. So... Let's see how we go. I mean, I wish I could have been good at housework uh, or housework minded sort of person but I just haven't got the ability to be able to motivate myself to do it and as a consequence yeah I just wanted to even if I could earn another twenty dollars a week that would have been I felt that would have been enough or something like that or fifty dollars a week but I just could never get a job no one would fucking hire me I really found that annoying. Uh, you do, you feel bad, it makes you feel bad about yourself. 
I didn't start working in, until I actually left school and maybe it was a good thing that I didn't have a job because I have disabilities that prevent me from working fast, efficiently and accurately. So I had, at birth I had a cord around my neck and I came out breech and had suffered from oxygen starvation and that damaged parts of my brain making making me well it's probably not the full story but basically it would have had a huge impact on how I actually would have worked and I didn't know that I think my mum did tell me that uh, but I didn't know that it was actually a problem I'd never been diagnosed with anything they never detected why my school performance was really laggy and bad. Uh, well, I kept lagging behind in everything nearly. School, not everything, but a lot of things. And it just got worse by the end of high school. But, yeah, that looks really quite nice. I think now we can call this demo quits.